After being in the industry for more than a decade, Brianne Howie has recently gotten to a place in her career where major opportunities are really rolling in. She has previously appeared in Batwoman, Dollface, The Passage, and The Exorcist, among others TV shows, but Ginny and Georgia is her biggest role yet. Here are 10 things you probably didn't know about Brianne Howie. She wanted to be a flight attendant as a kid. Howie never dreamed of becoming an actress as a kid. Instead, she wanted to be a flight attendant and traveling the world, but life clearly had other plans. Once she discovered acting, she knew there was no turning back. She travels often. Her dream of becoming a flight attendant didn't come true, but her dream to travel the world certainly has. Thanks to her job as an actress, she has gotten to visit all sorts of different places. Some of the countries she's been to include Italy, Australia, and Portugal. She attended an all-girls Catholic school. Growing up, Howie attended an all-girls Catholic school, where she was a self-proclaimed good girl and where her fellow students weren't nearly as mean as TV shows and movies will lead you to believe. She spent most of her time concentrating on getting good grades in high school, but she also discovered her love of improv during that time. She told Imagista, I think it was there that I kind of found my voice because I was involved in improv and the plays, and I would also do the plays at the all-boys school. It was just sort of what all the cool girls were doing. She booked her first job while attending New York University. After high school, Howie studied drama at New York University's Tisch School of the Arts, where she started looking at acting in a different lens. She appeared in a handful of short films, including Sucker Punch, Appropriate Sex, and Party Favors, among others. Before graduating a semester early in 2011, she even booked her first ever TV role. She said, my first audition was for the CW's 90210. I remember being very nervous and showing up way too early. I went in for the role of Girl in Green and ended up booking a different role with the name, Stacy. Her character appeared in episode 4 of season 3, and though it was a small part, it was enough to kick off her career. She minored in child psychology in college. In addition to her major in drama, Howie decided to minor in child psychology, though she said she chose that minor almost by accident. As she explained to Imagista, I found myself taking all of those college classes, and before I knew it my college counselor was like, you know you basically have a minor. All the classes I chose to take fulfilled the requirements for the child psychology program. I love kids, I am from a huge family, and I think I have always been curious to know why we are the way we are, which I believe all stems from our childhood. She has four siblings. Howie has four younger siblings, and she told Complex that she's very close to her large family. She said, both my parents remarried and had more, so three of them are much younger. It was cool to play a kind of different role in their life, being a little bit older than them. I'd be running them to their practices and helping them with their homework and just kind of watching them grow up. And though she feels a lot of pressure as the eldest, she enjoys being a role model. It's nice, when you have someone looking up to you, they think everything you do is so cool. She played in two short-lived vampire shows. 2013 marked Howie's first time playing the same character for more than just a few episodes. That year, she appeared in a short show called Red Scare, which follows 10 strangers, including Howie's teenager character Audrey Stone, who are forced to lock themselves in a fallout shelter during an air raid only to discover that one of them is secretly a vampire. A few years later, in 2019, Howie popped up in another vampire-centric show, Fox's The Passage. The series depicts a US government experiment gone wrong, in which a group of death row inmates are turned into infectious vampires. Howie plays one of the inmates, a woman named Shauna Babcock. Unfortunately, the passage garnered mediocre reviews and ratings, and thus was cancelled after one season. Her first leading role. Over the years, Howie has appeared in guest roles in shows like Criminal Minds, Baby Daddy, Heart of Dixie, and many other TV shows. She also had a role in the Jennifer Aniston, Jason Bateman movie Horrible Bosses too. Her acting credits steadily grew, and in 2015, she earned one of her first leading roles, portraying the model Scarlett in the Comedy Central sitcom I Leave With Models. She moved to London to film the series. She met her future husband in a bar. Howie first met her future husband, Matt Zyring, at a bar in LA. He was celebrating after taking the bar exam and Howie was enjoying a night out with friends. Apparently, the two happened to run each other again the following night, and then the night after that. Five years later, they are still together, but unfortunately, their October 2020 Santa Barbara wedding was put on hold due to the ongoing coronavirus pandemic. She told Los Angeles Magazine, We cancelled our wedding. We couldn't get married in 2020, but we did get a dog. 
The couple adopted their Australian Shepherd Mix Bodie in March 2020, and they hope to finally tie the knot sometime in 2021. She is all about social justice. Howie certainly isn't afraid to speak her mind, and she has used her platform as a way to raise awareness to the things that are important to her. She is a strong supporter of the fight to end racism, and she has also shown her support for LGBTQ and women's rights. She also has a link in her bio for an organization called Donors Choose, which is dedicated to helping teachers get the resources they need to do their jobs effectively.